So that is the Supreme Burger. Wrapped up pretty tight, as you can see by the top bun. It looks like he's been under a 10 ton press. Hello everyone, and welcome back to Food Review Club. I just wanted to say, before we crack on with this review, we've got a sponsor. Down there, the meat man. Thank you for sponsoring yet again another video. Guys, he's a nation's butcher. What, if they don't have it on their website, it's not worth having. And yes, we've got a discount code for the FRC family to enjoy. It is FRC10. Click the link in the comments below, go to the website, check out the shop, and you'll be very, very happy with what you see. Barbecue season is around the corner, slash we're in the guts of it at the moment. Get involved. Now, Callum, we are at the biggest Dixie chicken I've ever seen in my entire life. Here we go. Look at the size of that. It's the sort of Dix, Dixie uh, that you have to stop and uh, get out and have a, a look and a stare, a touch and a prod a stroke even, it's massive. I've never seen one so big in my entire life. So. <laughs> you love a big Dixie, don't yeah, you? Yeah, we love a big Dixie. This must be where the King Dixie lives. Big Dicks only. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> now, before we like, get on with this as well, like, where are you watching this video from right now, guys? We'd love to see where you're watching this from. Put in the comments the exact location where you're watching from. Are you around the world? Are you from England? It's really cool to see where you guys are from now. We've gone for the Supreme Meal, Callum. Five pounds 49, drink, it's very windy here by the way. Drink, chips, and I've got some extra wings. And the burger, now let's start with a burger. This is kind of where it's won or lost for us. So that is the Supreme Burger. Wrapped up pretty tight as you can see by the top bun. It looks like he's been under a 10 ton press. Um, but let's have a quick look inside, shall we? So there we have it. We've got the hash brown. We've got the cheese. We've got the chicken fillet. Mayo, a generous helping of mayo. A lot of mayo. And some lettuce. These places, as we know, are big value, but they also are very hit and miss. Where's your favorite chicken shop? Let me know, because I'm struggling at the moment. Um, okay, here we go. Mate, that's decent. The chicken's got a wonderful flavor to it. It's got that little element of crisp to it. Uh, it's not too dry, feels freshly cooked, still retaining its moisture. The hash brown on top is doing absolute wonders for the texture. The cheese, the mayo, I'm pleasantly surprised with that, you know, bro. Mm. That was good. That's really good. Not annoyed with that. Wow. Now, next, chips. Always difficult. You know, people say chips are chips, which they're not. There we go, look. Bit of salt on there. Here we go. Uh, yeah, we're just doing a food review. Oh, cool. Yeah, man. Just like we, uh, we eat. Hey, Joe, why didn't we review? Yeah. <laughs> you okay, mate? You lost, what have you lost? One of our brethren, he's, ah. he's got a five of our money and we're in a kind of a shit state. All right, bro. Well, good luck. Thank you, YouTube. Bless up. I hope the review goes well. Thanks, mate. Um, is his mate a, a fucking hawk or a dog? His mate was, he's whistling like a, some, like, sort of, some, like, sort of, Mick Dundee. I don't know what's going on there, bro. They're no. out patrolling. No idea what's going on. Anyway. They need that fiver. Yeah, they need the fiver. Come on. Help them out, boys and girls. Here's the chips. Let's dive in. What are we looking for here? Hot? I hope they're hot. Hot, frozen. You know, you know the vibe? They're frozen chips. They're not, they're not award winners, but... Again, not too bad. Not too bad. Now, I suppose we're on to the last hurdle here now. I mean, all that for £5.50. In this day and age and in this climate, you can't go wrong, can you? 
If you're eating on fast food on a budget, I rate it. See, that other, other side fried was best part of 20 quid for that. Come on. Anyway, here we go. The chicken wings. This is where they're probably going to fall over, if they are going to fall over at all. Now, it looks kind of crispy, but it also looks like a bit oily and it looks a bit like... Very oily. Very oily, yeah. Has that compromised the outer crisp? There's only one way to find out, bro. It looks super oily, man. Super oily. Swimming. Yeah. All right. That knuckle off. That knuckle off, look. Man's a pro. Okay. Very oily. Like, super fing oily. I can feel it on my hand. I might need a bath after this, but. <laughs> yes, bro, how's it going? Yes, bro. What are you saying? Chilling, bro. Come on. <laughs> This is the most noisiest car behind. I guarantee you hear some. Here we go. Come on. It's a terrible car. It's a fing shit. Right. That flavour of the wings is banging. They were crisp. They were oily, but they were so crispy, it kind of like was all right, to be fair. And there's loads of cayenne, loads of heat. I can feel it in my mouth right now. They're, there's nothing worse than getting hot wings that are not hot. I'm not talking temperature, I'm talking about spice. They've got it. You just need a bath afterwards, but apart from that... Yeah, they're, they're, look, they're not exactly huge. They're very small. Bottom end of the spectrum. This is not going to get a big score, but listen to the words I'm saying. Every part of that was OK. Not bad. Big dicks was pulled it out of the bag. I'm happy. Um, time for a score. I'm going to give this like a, a pleasant 7.8 out of 10. Thanks for watching everyone. I hope you've enjoyed today's video. And once again, thank you to The Meat Man for sponsoring this video. If you haven't already, subscribe to the channel. Turn the notification bell on. That, that means every time we upload a video, you get a notification. And don't forget to go and follow us on Instagram. We've got pug shoots behind the camera, me in front of it. But today, that is a review. People licking your lips, checking the dips. We're checking out the best of the bunch. So you can get your best breakfast, dinner, or lunch. It's Matt D and Jess coming with a full review. We've been traveling, trying to find the best foods for you. Yeah, now that's a review.